You're, you're more like a, you're more like a media when you really get there and you go into this zone and you really divorce yourself of who you are mm -hmm. and you just become a garment that something else puts on. <laughs> now, right. a lot of people sit up there and do impersonations of other folks mm -hmm. instead of allowing that spirit. But I sit up and I'll pray for a little bit and go in a dark place. Um, mm -hmm go in the bathroom, turn off the lights, look in the mirror. We'll have the light on at first, and then after one minute, turn the light off and, and search until you find, see your own glow, your own aura, and then you watch it change. Wow. And it's a scary thing yeah. because you'll feel like some hands are on you, wow. and you lose a little bit of control of what you're doing, mm -hmm. but, you know, if you stay with it, you know, you'll be inhabited by mm -hmm. something, and then you walk out, the character wow. with you and you got to know how to say goodbye to it wow. if you really want to yeah. get there a lot of people are afraid mm -hmm. to empty themselves mm -hmm. and be filled up with something else mm -hmm. but you know as an actor you're an emotional prostitute wow you know you put Yikes. on whatever you need for the job mm -hmm. put on you're turning a trick you're turning an emotional trick wow and it's no nothing yeah. more glorious yeah. than that <laughs> like the honest I know that wig is taking on, but he's saying some crazy stuff. Yes, but that worry is <laughs> that don't let the wig, wig. distract yeah. you. <laughs> yeah. That was wild what he just said. Yeah. Golly, I'll be honest, the wig distracted me. <laughs> I was sitting there like black Brady Bunch. So he was on the set for a movie he's doing with Kevin Hart and everybody. So yeah. that's why he was looking like that. But okay, good. Did y'all hear what he said? Yes, yeah. dude, it's crazy. This Negro. I think said. I think a lot of <laughs> actors and actresses do that though. We hey. Look, y'all think we plan when we say this stuff is I mean, real? This is real. That's like, kind of uh, even me. You know, I come in yeah, here and I'm yeah. like, is that this is conspiracy? Is <laughs> this man is saying straight out of his face that he uh, accepts demons into his body to control him so he acts better. But didn't somebody yeah, say? Didn't, didn't somebody say? I can't. I don't. Idris Damson said he called yeah, the devil. Yeah, exactly. Idris, yeah. But they were saying that these these movies, some of the movie roles are just. I heard somebody say it. I don't, don't want to name the actress because I don't. I can't remember when she said it because I don't want to take her. Halle Berry. But but she was saying like like these 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 roles are nothing but spirits roaming, and once you accept them, then you have to. Halle Berry said that. Like that. Okay, mm -hmm. I don't know because she played that Dorothy Dandridge role, and she said she connected with something and they dressed off flying around the room. And wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was uh, what Heath Ledger said about playing the um, Joker. The Joker. Hey That's guys, cool. this is weird. <laughs> yeah. This Negro said, I go well, in the bathroom well, I'll say this. and cut the I, I, lights I'm not off saying and look in the mirror in the dark. I, don't, I would say this. That doesn't happen. I don't think every actor and actress well, do that. saying they, they not real. He's yeah. saying they ain't ready for this. Yeah, that's what he's saying. Like Because if that's the, the next step if you want to get those academy. Because I remember back in the day, and it was a video of Denzel saying, like, I was talking to spirits to get into this role. Hey, yo. That's I don't know if he's still good. doing that, but. Hey. This is crazy. So, so not only are they doing that, but then we go and sit there and watch them. We watch yeah, the spirit yeah. dance around on the screen. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's what this is. I mean, this but, is serious. but 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 think about it. It's some roles that we look at certain people, and you be like, "That wasn't them. That was such and such." You know what I mean? And it's like, "Yeah, it was such and such." No, it wasn't. <laughs> it wasn't such and such. It yeah. was a demon. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ain't so nobody got got I, up in him. I it just, was a demon. Yeah, I just I just think, man, for all uh. The believers in Hollywood, if you come across this video, man, pray and really understand this industry, man. Yo, quit. <laughs> yeah. I don't pray, but no, get out. Yeah. No, but what I'm saying, I'm, I'm saying it could be Christian <laughs> actors. I mean, I don't think nobody. I mean, I think the preferably yo, the Holy Spirit. I'm starting to wonder, bro. I'm we, starting to wonder. This too. is one. This is one of our man, oldest, so, wait, oldest. Wait, 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 wait. Some of the yeah. Christian movies are bad. Movies are not. <laughs> they not going. I'm not talking about people do Christian <laughs> movies. It doesn't even count. Yeah. What I'm saying is, if you out there in real like situations, <laughs> I'm starting to wonder yeah. if you could be a Christian doing that. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. like, you remember the old topic we did? The can you be a Christian actor? Uh -huh. <laughs> Yo, I don't know. I don't know because, of course, yes, you can. But if if God's if he's not dead, make some money, Sean. <laughs> it's fine. It's, it's I think excluded he's so from trying. this conversation. That's yeah. not what we're talking about. Yeah, we're um, talking about dark Hollywood. Yeah, so so yeah. <laughs> if if he if this is a common if like this is not just isolated because yeah he's, he's not the only person. one doing this he's a strange person yeah. but <laughs> it sounds like he's saying this is what happens yeah mm -hmm. and we saw Damson Idris said we did, we did that topic and he said he did that yeah 
if y'all don't, if what do y'all think is happening? Do, he clearly knows something weird is going on here, right? Yeah. You're okay with that? Right after that, he said there's no good and evil. So he probably doesn't even realize yeah. how dangerous what he's yeah. doing. Is. So if this is happening in Hollywood and this is made for our entertainment, what is happening to us? If we're just accepting th- these people are controlling the media, they're doing this kind of nonsense to to get the stuff on screen. What is going on? Like, are we just... A, because well, I'm not the conspiracy guy, but mm. are we just ignoring a huge problem where we're yeah. ingesting all this media from people doing this nonsense? Yeah, yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, I we think are we are. giving them that, trophies. Ain't no way around yeah. it. We are the, from the music to the movies. I'm just, I'm just sitting here thinking in my mind, but like, dang, all this stuff really is corrupt. Like, all this, <laughs> yeah. like we are like we Yo. know what we say, but really think about it. We're surrounded by darkness, bro. The mm. entertainment and stuff we get, mm-hmm. like. It's people in the bathroom in the dark looking at the mirror and <laughs> wait till he start glowing to play a role. Yeah, yeah, that's nuts. And I think people have a desire to be like huge Famous, and successful. Yeah. So I don't believe every actor is doing it. Some folks are just content with just being in movies. But people who are trying to be at the top of the top, they're trying to get the Oscars and the Golden Globes and stuff. They're like, man, it's only a few sources of power you're going to go to in this life. If you ain't going to God, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And I will like, say this. I mean, when, when, me, and, when me and Maya visit L.A., I did know that it's, it's a very spiritual place. It's a very spirit. And I'm not just talking about church. I'm talking about all types of. Oh, we were there for the BT it's Awards. Heavy, we saw it's, it. it's a lot of. We saw it. Um, it tarot cards and all that. It's, it's heavy, bro. And, and the, remember the, the video? Um, you uh, The video of Rock the Bells? The one that you. It was like the behind the scenes of the rock industry. You showed me that uh, years ago. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But, um, but they had one. I, I don't think you. Sh- did you have the Hollywood Unmasked? It was something about Hollywood, but but back in the day they were doing that. They yeah, were this, there's yeah, no, there's this no, is no, this is not new. No, no, no. This no, is not no. new. Old school Lucio Ball and all those type folks back in the day they were doing stuff like this. So, so yeah. I don't think uh, maybe some of y'all are like me where it's like, I mean, they, this can't they can't really be doing this. Who would be that dumb? I'm t- they're that dumb. <laughs> you think we, you yeah. think we desensitize to some of this stuff? What do you mean? In what way? I think. We see so much darkness and wickedness around. It's almost like with school shootings, right? Mm-hmm. When Columbine happened, it was a frenzy. Now it's like we'll talk about it for a couple of days. It's, it's not that big deal. And anymore, it's not a big yeah. deal. So it's like with this stuff, it's like we know Hollywood is wicked. We yeah. know the music industry is wicked. We keep but, trying to get in it. But these are things that we've been presented with Dang. that make it seem like it's the place to be where you can make money and fame and live out your wildest dreams. And we keep pursuing the things that we know are wicked. <laughs> we can come uh, on this show and get a Beyonce lyric and pretty much tell you how she worshiping another god. We can tell you how Ke- Kehlani doing Santeria. And people will still go out here on their Apple Music and Spotify platform on their way to work or riding around the car with their kids and still play this stuff. It's yeah. like... Wow. What is going on in our minds <laughs> like, yeah. to what we don't understand? <laughs> yeah. It's evil at play. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, are we yeah. just so used to evil that we just like, ah, it's just a little evil. <laughs> <laughs> We're good. Just a little sin. Well, we bl- right. Blameless. Uh, we, 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 blameless yeah. um, one of the one of our people in the chat said, acting has its roots back in ancient Greece when it was part of worshiping the pagan gods, including Apollo. Mm. I mean. I'm just so I'm just this is because it's a hypocrite. An actor's a hypocrite. That's you know what I mean. Yeah. In essence, that word comes from that. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean. You're pretending to be somebody else. Yeah. So this is more so for the for the young Christian actors coming up. How are you going to navigate this world? It's, he's not saying that he didn't in this video say you're forced to do it or whatever, right? So yeah. it's not like I mean I'm sure that happens too, but mm-hmm. it, I was more so looking at the lady's reaction, right? It was more like. <laughs> What? <laughs> but but she, like, she this, this wasn't her seat. first interview with him, yeah. so it's like this is a friend. You yeah. know, you feel privileged to have this opportunity to talk to him. Yeah. So it's like you're not gonna be like what? Right. <laughs> That's what I. I mean, I don't know if I could have helped myself if I was talking to him. I'd be like, what do you talk? Do what? You do what? I'm like, bro, what are you talking about? Mm-hmm. Cut, cut. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You mean you just admitted that you are you that comfortable with me? Right. Are, did you hear what you just said? Yeah. That's nuts. Desensit- you he just but, felt, he's sitting there with a ridiculous <laughs> wig on. Yeah, I just get possessed by demons and act. But let's go back. Wait, let's, wait, let's, wait, let's, let's hold go. on. Wait, why would you be proud? Like, okay, t- to me, what makes acting so like, oh, wow, he did a good job is that 
you that method acting. You you yeah. you did something impressive. Like you you were you pretended to be this person. Yeah. You're basically saying it wasn't even you. Yeah. Why are yeah. you bragging about that? I wouldn't tell anybody that. Yeah. You're basically but, saying somebody else did it. I was just I I, I was just a puppet. <laughs> Why but, you? But, that's but, not even impressive. But think about this. Remember when um um my man from um, Snowfall said that. Come on, devil. Remember he said that and everybody was looking at him like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like this ain't Your nothing first new. Song? Yeah. <laughs> they were looking at him like, they looking at him like, don't say that. Like, don't tell everybody so, that. So, what, like, so what's our advice to our young brothers and sisters who like, like, I mean, we have artists and actors yeah. that watch the show. It's like, yeah. How do you deal with but this? But also back in the day, remember that's how Sasha Fierce was born. Cause Beyonce said the same thing, a spirit into her and Sasha Fierce was born. Back in the day, she's, it's a video of her saying, I, I just that. said, I hey, said, find it and let's do it. Yeah, I I, she video. said, she said, I, find I, it, find I it. Video. Yeah, I think I did. Yeah, too. she um, said, I just stand right here and the spirit comes upon me. And see, see the, growing up when I was younger, I, I'm like, is this just like a turn of phrase? Or, or like, do they understand the seriousness of what they're saying? Or is it just like, like, you know, like something you just kind of yeah. say flippantly? Yeah. But no, no, no. They're really doing it. Yeah. yeah. That's nuts, guys. Hey, stop. <laughs> Cut it out. Evil at play, man. Cut it out. Imagine somebody doing that for God's not day. <laughs> <laughs> so you asked what was the advice that what, we would what, give. What, what? Actually, mm-hmm. actually, actually, you better be because it's you better be influenced by some kind of spirit, either the Holy Spirit. <laughs> but it's, you, you can't. I'm if it, if I'm it's sure just you, praying. that's not good either, I'm right? Showing the, I'm showing the Kendrick brothers are praying before they do scenes. Right, but stuff. what I'm saying is, is that like you, you are being inhabited <laughs> by a spirit some way or another. Yeah, you choose. Yeah, you're gonna be ha- doing Holy what spirit? he's doing, or you like if something's going to yeah. take over, right? Yeah. So I think I but think do you think God can, do you think God would inhabit somebody? Do you think God would inhabit? Do you okay? Of course, he inhabits us with the Holy Spirit. So do you think the Holy Spirit would give somebody something for a movie role to get to reach somebody? What do you mean? Give them what? Like, no, to give them that, <laughs> that <laughs> give them that extra act to, to the point where somebody's like, I saw that movie and I went and got saved after that movie. Yeah. Okay. So it's, yeah. the, it's not the same thing, but it's. Yeah. Mm. It's, okay. It's, yeah. It's, it's the good guy version. Of yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I think the yeah. advice is you got to tell people, you know, what. Be careful which roles you accept. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, make sure that you know if you're, I mean, the people that you're working with. That's, that's really important. But is it even possible? Is my I question. think so. I, think, I don't think Denzel possess. He said that, he said that Denzel said the same thing. He said that year back in the day. Like, oh, for real? Like, I think. No. This was like, year, <laughs> this, this was like years ago. <laughs> this was like around the glory <laughs> time, the Malcolm X time, where he was talking say, about like yo. that. He be talking, you know, so he be talking right. Find that clip. Okay, I'll try to find we that. Next show planned out already. <laughs> that, that right there, that'd be disappointing right there. But that was back. I don't know if he's doing that now. Yeah, That's yeah. what I'm saying. Hey, you got an answer to that, brother. Yeah, I brother. think I think he Can't probably had that other room. <laughs> I think training day was probably something that would have caused him to say something like that. Like you got to be a mean character, a mean person, a mean spirited person. You, hey, it ain't nothing. They yeah. no role, that no Mitchell. job, no position, no opportunity yeah. worth. Yeah. Going in the dark and asking the yeah. demon to possess you. No, that's not like no candy man. Well, I would say this: <laughs> for some, for some people, you don't know their desperate level. You don't know if you this be is as desperate as you th- want. I'm, I'm saying for for, <laughs> for a Terrence Howard. Let's, let's, I would say I would say think about a Terrence Howard. Like prior to Empire, what was something that was popping off for him? He st- all he had was oh, hustling yeah. and flow. Yeah, was like, yeah, but it was. It was I mean, it didn't it didn't really do much for him like Empire did. Nah, it didn't. Yeah. So is it from Blameless? God does not distinguish reality from pretending and acting. If you play a role of fornicator to God, there is not a difference. Do you believe that? Mm. We've gone over this when um, Kirk Cameron was saying that he always calls his wife in for kissing roles. Remember that? Um, Remember (laughs) Kirk Cameron? Mm -hmm. He always said that if he was going to do a role where he kissed a woman in in a movie, it had to be his wife. Okay. Yeah. So I feel like a lot of people take that seriously. Like you can't. You can't yeah, yeah, yeah. be cheating I mean, on your that, spouse like that's that. That's a big question. We probably need to do it as a separate topic because that was our original topic. topic. Yeah. That's why I brought it up because we've talked about this for years. Yeah. We've asked like Braylon Evans yeah. and all that. And I'm, I mean, even when they say the answer, I'm like, okay. <laughs> so, so, he, so he asking, can you play the role of a fornicator without actually being a fornicator? Yeah. I just can. Yeah, I think so. Wait, it's even worse than that. It's like he's basically no, saying God no, can't no. tell the difference. Oh, God can't say nah, I don't I don't necessarily agree with that. I think I could be an actor in a movie and we could talk about you're just gonna be the uh 
like the cheating husband who just out here, uh, who's an adulterer. I'm not really an adulterer when well, you cut the camera off. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But I could play the role so you can get the picture. With That's the, like saying Ernest was was a fornicator now because of the thing. <laughs> yeah, it's like <laughs> the film you did. The, the movie is just trying to paint a picture. Like you can have a Christian you film. you direct? Yeah. yeah. We're all complicit. <laughs> Even if it's a Christian film about Shut a young, this whole thing yeah, young single man who just trying to find his way. You're going to throw me under the bus, Sean. <laughs> He's out here having sex with different women in the movie, but then, you know, he meets Christ and then Christ. If it's a yeah, Christian film, so yeah. like, you, you could play a role without it being who you are. The point is, is that if you're gonna do this at all, you ha- you have to have good guys and bad guys in your script. Yeah. Like my my dad, when he um he was th- in Atlanta, they had this thing called the Passion Play, this huge yeah, yeah. play in Atlanta, mm-hmm. and he played he played one of the guards that had to say crucify him. Uh, so is at that. that moment, does that make him? One of the the people I stoned who, Jesus. But he did crucify him. Easter Sunday. <laughs> I stoned him. Well, stone, right, but what I does stone Jesus? Does that immediately make him that that person <laughs> and in oh, real oh, life? Oh, oh, <laughs> yeah, I'm, try, I'm trying to focus too. How, how could you? <laughs> Easter Sunday. Crucify him ain't bad at stone. <laughs> yeah, Easter, stone Easter, Easter, Easter Sunday. Easter Sunday. Yeah. Rocks, yeah. <laughs> yeah. How could you do it, bro? <laughs> How big rocks. How, how big was the rock? <laughs> how big was the rock? Oh man! Uh, it was I little think, sponges. I think, you know, I what think, I mean? I think God. <laughs> I think it depends on your heart. To me, I think God sees your heart and He sees yeah. how far you willing it's to take. It's the intention the of intention. why. Why is this? Why does this movie exist? The, if the movie exists at some point to bring glory to God. There, there's going to be. Yeah. You have to show the bad and the good along. Yeah. Uh, along it's almost the way like somebody's to testimony. Yeah. I say this. It didn't feel good stoning Jesus. Like you felt like, <laughs> yeah. Like I got in the car driving home and I was like, Ugh. God, I'm sorry. 